guys welcome back to my channel and today we're gonna be doing twice as Santa's look in cheer up so I'll fix my hair first and I'm gonna be mixing a base by Maybelline and their foundation by Maybelline also I love mixing these two together because when I do there's a pearly sheen to the foundation so it doesn't look too matte when it gets on my skin especially after it sets Okay, so now I'll be putting some lip balm to prep my lips. Then I'll be working on my eyebrows. Sana has straight eyebrows. When I say straight, she really has straight eyebrows. So I'll be trying to do a straight eyebrow, maybe with a little bit of a curve because I have a natural curve. And after you do one eyebrow, make sure you do the other in front of a mirror and make sure it's even. Then I'm going to be using powder just to soften the inner part of my eyebrows. Make sure to do a gradient so it doesn't look too strong. After that, I'll be using eyebrow mascara to lighten up my eyebrows since I've already said I am dark haired so this is just going to soften my eyebrows a little more. Use a blending brush to naturally highlight and define your nose bridge. Now I'll be using my eyeshadow palette by Sleek called Oh So Special. I'll be using the color The Mail right at the bottom and I'll be using it as a base on my eyes. I like using a nude color this time because I'll be adding on something later. I'll be using the color Bow for my brow bone and my nose line just to highlight it and also under my eyes. I'll be using the color Box to give my lower lash line a more defined look and I'll also be creating a triangle in the outer corner of my eye just so that I can extend my eye line so it gives that illusion that my eyes are actually a little bigger than they are. Sana's look is very sparkly so I'll be adding some glittery eyeshadow on my eyelids and also on the inner corner of my eyes. Next up, use some brown eyeliner to define the eyes. Don't forget to draw the line as close as you can to the lash line and make the wing go downwards and extend it just a little. Also define the lower lashes carefully. Make sure to let it dry first. Then we're going to be adding on some falsies. I picked a very natural set in brown. To blend my lashes together, I'll be using some mascara on both the upper and lower lashes. Please be careful and make sure not to smudge. I'll be using a very pink blush, a matte pink blush, and put it on the apple of my cheeks. Make sure to keep it on the apple of your cheeks. You don't want looking pink all over. The next most important step is adding highlighter. So this is going to be like strobing and we'll be adding it on our cheekbones and the T-zone. Just the important parts where light hits the face. Sana has bright pink lips, so if you have any bright pink lipstick, that's going to be fine as long as it's on the red side, not on the violet side too much. And then make sure to blot off all the excess product and add a coat of lip gloss on top. It can be clear, it can be a little bit shimmery and pink. For the finishing touch, we'll be adding on some shimmery under eye glitter. So we'll be putting it in the inner corner and spreading it out very carefully. And now we're all done. That's it. So I fixed my hair up like Sana and tried to copy her look as much as I could. And if you guys like my video and my makeup tutorial, please give it a thumbs up. Do subscribe and leave your comments and suggestions below, especially if you want to see a K-pop look. Thank you for watching, guys. See you!